Welcome to 31st of May's Holy Blessings. Supreme Father says that may you renounce carelessness, laziness. Alasse al belapan. And any trace of impurity. And become completely wiseless. When there are ups and downs in your daily timetable, when you have laziness or carelessness, so we are in the mood of doing something and then suddenly we like, oh, let's do it tomorrow or let's postpone it or I don't, I'm not in the mood to do it right now. I'm feeling lazy to do it and then we postpone things. We are putting more and more of stress onto our mind because then we have, we'll have the same thing which we are supposed to do today to be handed over tomorrow and handle tomorrow so we'll have tomorrow's work also and today's work also so stress is increasing we are increasing it on our own it is because of a trace of vice that also has an impact on your becoming worthy of worship now worthy of worship souls do not shout do not get irritated do not get frustrated do not get jealous of others now if you're postponing things if you're lazing around god says then automatically tomorrow when you have too much of stress on yourself, you'll be shouting at people, your workers, you'll be shouting at your uh, colleagues or you'll be shouting at your subordinates because you are putting all the stress onto them, what you have accumulated actually. There'll be negative attitudes towards things, frustration, irritation, and then if you're not able to succeed, jealousy because you're postponing things and you're becoming lazy, that also leads it also leads to jealousy because you see other people moving ahead and you are lagging behind so it doesn't make us worthy of worship because then we don't have good traits of worshipable souls so if you do not experience yourself to be fully awake at Amrit Vila no, Baba is giving an example Amrit Vila is 4 o'clock in the morning generally even before that but if you take an average 4 o'clock in the morning till 4.45 to 5 o'clock if you sit out of compulsion or with laziness, you're getting out in the morning at 4 o'clock, you're sitting out of compulsion. Compulsion would be in what way? Let's say you're sitting in a center or you're staying in a center and you are somewhere with soul and you see somebody looking at you when you're lying down on your bed at 4 o'clock, not waking up, you get taunts. People talk about you you're like, oh, let's get up otherwise people are going to talk about me. So you sit in compulsion because what will people think? First thing, second thing is you are a senior brother, sister, and and you're seeing everybody else is waking up, moving faster than you in in pushyat or in or doing spiritual endeavor, and you that's why you want to show others that no, you are the senior, or you are doing it faster, you're doing it better. So you're sitting out of compulsion just to show others, not truly to connect to the supreme creator or father, or with laziness, and you're sleep in one corner, you're sleeping off your physically present but not mentally present your worshippers will then also worship you with a feeling of compulsion or with laziness they'll do the same thing because we're sending those vibrations to them so renounce laziness and carelessness and you will then be able to become completely wiseless we'll be able to remove frustration we'll be able to remove irritation we'll be able to remove the stress we'll be able to remove jealousy and many negative things just because we're doing things on time i'm shanti